Hey guys, on today's video, we're gonna go over your titles right here in Final Cut Pro. So if you have this problem, for example, here on the left, I have this title that's blurry. We can see that. Now let me give you an example of the same one, but it's nice and crisp. So as you guys can see, it's not blurry at all. So these are two videos and the way that I fixed it. So this is a workaround, really, around the problem. I will be coming up with a good fix, but as of now, this is the only workaround that I found. So first of all, make sure that your fonts are all good. So that's the first thing. I've noticed that when you have these problems with something being pixelated or something like that, your fonts. So sometimes uh, some of you may have Adobe fonts or any other fonts that are synced online. Just make sure they're properly synced and you should be okay. Other than that, it's better and best to just go ahead and install those fonts on your Mac. Now, if that's not the problem, the fonts that you're using are exactly from your MacBook, you haven't added anything, done anything, then that's okay. You can go on, let's just open up Final Cut Pro. Here's Final Cut Pro. Now before, let me just open this up and right here my projects. It's gonna allow, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna go right here and all the way right here. So this title right here, this one right here is actually blurry-ish. Now it doesn't really matter if it's blurry-ish once you're editing it. It shouldn't be blurry anymore once you render it, right? Once you export it and you're good to go. However, even here I can see that's a little bit blurry. Now let me show you on this video. You guys can already see even in, in the preview, it's already nice and crisp. So it's not pixelated. Well, except for the A. That we can see that pixelation a little bit. Again, it doesn't matter that much, but there's already a difference right now in the preview. Now, what did I just do? What I did was right here under our titles. So on the top left hand side, you're gonna see your titles. Don't choose any of these 360 ones just yet. I haven't found a quick fix for them just yet. So just keep scrolling down, keep scrolling down and just use a basic 3D. Basic 3D look awesome and they don't have to be 360, all right? so. If you maybe placed a 360 already and you wanna try out these basic ones, you're gonna see that you're getting pretty much the same thing. So as of now, just drag one of these basic ones, put it down here and use the basic one. Now, of course, the first thing you should do to test this out is just make a small clip and then export it and see what's working, what's not. So that's what I did right here. This is really small video. Just cut the size of this video just for the title to test things out and see how things work. But again, you should always check your fonts. So on the right hand side, you will see font and then just choose something else and see maybe if the font is the actual problem. Because it could also be the font like I mentioned before. So right now, those are the two fixes that I have for you. You will also notice that once you change it up here, it's gonna be all normal. You can move around this thing up, down. It doesn't really matter. You're free to move this. Where with the 360, maybe you were trying to move the title and that wasn't working either. So if I move a 360 here, let me just put that there. You will notice there's my 360. Besides being blurry already, I can't really move it like the basic one. So it does work different. I'm gonna delete it for now. And anyways, that would be it for this video. Quick fix. It's really just a workaround for now. We will find a definite fix later on, but for now, this is what you guys can do in order to get your videos going. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.